à tous et bienvenue sur Batman Vous êtes en compagnie d'Arios et, et on va tout de suite reprendre le film de notre aventure. Salut, c'est encore moi. Welcome back, Mr. Wayne. You can go on in. Hey, <rire> gentil. I'm back. Yes, that's right. The back. I'll need a rental in the meantime. Uh, Harvey? Uh, back here, Bruce. Uh, take a seat. I'll be right out. Oh, come on, not today. Stop, stop, stop. God, I have to stop. <laughs> Uh, just a second. Well, it's, it's good as it's gonna get. Uh, you know, Bruce, I've been looking forward to this my entire career. The day Harvey Dent takes his official portrait as mayor of Gotham. And he looks like this. Glad you survived the trip up here, Bruce. You want to tell me what's going on? I didn't keep you waiting that long, did I? I have reason to believe you're being watched. You sound paranoid, Bruce. The children of Arkham are hacking into the GCPD. They're likely keeping tabs on you, too. I'll handle it. Thank you, Bruce. Children of Arkham jump me. God, it's only getting worse. It's out of control. I can't stop it. Well, Harvey, you drew attention to yourself with that speech. You need to be more careful. Careful is what got us into this mess. Harvey Dent does everything by the book, to the letter of the law. But that isn't working. I'm sure it is. He's turning things around. Barely. Slowly. I'd like to see you do better. Watch me. Now are you gonna fix this mess? Simple. Easy. Curfews after dark. Checkpoints at every- Harvey, snap out of it. We all need to snap out of it! Sorry. So sorry about that, Bruce. I guess I got a little lost there. I'm probably not getting enough sleep these days. The stress. It's just the stress. Look, we're both under a lot of stress right now. We should be able to lean on each other. Stronger together, right? It's the only way. Uh, Mr. Dent? The photographer's ready for you. Thank you, Deborah. I'll be right out. Please, Bruce, don't tell anyone about this. If anyone finds out or thinks I'm not fit to be mayor, it's all over. Everything I've worked for. Your secret's safe with me, Harvey. <sighs> Thanks, Bruce. I owe you. Again. <laughs> again and again. <sighs> See you around, Bruce. Moi j'aime bien quand même ce masque qui tient tout seul. An interview with the children of Arkham's leader. I wonder how Vicky managed to score that. Bruce? Uh, have you seen today's copy of the Gazette? It just arrived a moment ago. It seems Miss Vale has been talking to some very interesting people. People the Batman would like to find. Do you think she would be willing to help you? She may be the only lead we have on the children of Arkham's leader. Perhaps she could be persuaded to reveal her source. Last time we talked, I gave her a pretty valuable tip. Sergeant Montoya's name. Though after this interview, I'm sure the police will become suspicious of all 
of Miss Vale's sources, and if they find out you leaked Montoya's name... True. We need to be careful. I can't afford to waste time with Vicky. Let's offer her a chat with Batman. Good idea, sir. Can you scramble the line? Right away. Vale. I saw your story in the Gazette this morning. I want to talk. Who... who is this? A friend of Gotham. Yeah, just a concerned citizen wishing to remain anonymous. Or do I now have Batman for a friend? If you stand for Gotham, then yes. I've been meaning to thank you. What you did at the debate. I'm not sure I would have made it out of there otherwise. I'd say I owe you one. Meet me at sundown. Cobblepot Park. Deal. Strange place to meet. Wasn't sure you were gonna show. Gotta admit, part of me thought it was a prank call. Nothing is ever this easy. I need some information from you. It's important. <laughs> yeah, figured as much. So, <laughs> Batman. I'll skip the obvious question. The children of Arkham seem to be your latest target. We all know their methods are extreme, but what about their message? Their leader claims that Gotham's elite have been abusing their power, often at the expense of ordinary citizens. For the record, do you think there's any validity to what they're saying? In your opinion. I don't want this conversation recorded. I thought we were here for an interview. Turn it off. Fine. Their message is picking up traction. Especially since the interview. I need to know everything they told you. Does no one read anymore? It was a lot of posturing and grandiose monologuing, really. We're going to purge the city of corruption sort of thing. Not great from an investigative standpoint, but the public will eat it up. Part of the job, you know? If that's the only reason you called me, you should really just read it yourself. They aren't trying to hide their motivations. Gotham needs to know how dangerous the children of Arkham really are. You are hiding the truth. Huh. My editor says the physical copies are practically sold out. I'd say the truth is getting out there. It just may not be the side you like. But that's why I'm here. To get the other half I'm missing. Where did you meet? How did they contact you? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. I'm not selling out a source. Not even for Batman. The circumstances of that meeting are confidential. Just like this one. I'm sure you wouldn't want me telling everyone how to get a hold of you. The children of Arkham hurt you too. They don't deserve your protection. Hmm, that's not up to me to decide. I have to remain unbiased. Something you should learn to do. What does that mean? I'm talking about Bruce Wayne. I still want to believe he's a good guy too, but... With the information that surfaced, everyone's angry. Everyone wants him to answer for what his family did. Everyone. Except for you. Why haven't you gone after him yet? No way he just slipped under your radar. But so far, no action from you against him. Bruce Wayne is innocent. He's not responsible for what his father did. Maybe not. But he still benefits from it. All those people suffered so that he could prosper up in that mansion of his. I'm not stupid. I know you have some connection with him. That data drive he gave me? That was from you. But you can't ignore the facts. Whether he intended to or not, his family has been stealing from innocent people for years. So, what are you gonna do about it? What is Batman doing to protect them from Bruce Wayne? The people wanna know. There are bigger threats to Gotham out there. The children of Arkham. I have to deal with them first. You're doing what you think is right. I get it. Good luck with the children of Arkham. I'll be sure your message gets out. <gasps> I can make you talk. You're, you're really going to threaten me. If you think I'm upholding our deal now, I 
I lose my job for this, but... Here. This is where we met for the interview. Just please, just don't tell anyone I gave this to you. Hmm. Batman, d'un simple regard, peut persuader les gens. Everything's dark, quiet. It's empty. No sign of the children of Arkham. They may not have gone far. They should be there. No security, no emergency staff. If Vicky's right, it shouldn't be this quiet. Be on your guard. I'll continue monitoring the drone feeds from here. Thanks. Go and have a look around. There's a body here. Likely the work of the children of Arkham. I'm gonna look around, see what they've been up to. He's been dead for a while from the looks of it. One of the children of Arkham. Loyalty doesn't get you much with these people, does it? Seems strange. There's something else. This man's veins. They look like Montoya's veins after she was drugged, only there's so much worse. The same drug from the debate. I feared we hadn't seen the last of it. There's no puncture mark here. No entry point for an injection. So, how did it get in his body? He was shot dead center. Twice. Executed. It outlived his usefulness, I suppose. They've been referencing the map. Whatever they're building must hinge on it somehow. This depot is pretty centrally located. A detonation device, but it's disabled. They must have intended to hook it up to something. The timer is set for 27 minutes and 13 seconds. From now? The numbers aren't moving. Doesn't seem to be counting down yet. This is how they were timing their route. Alfred, what stations are within a 27-minute train ride from this depot? Looking into the transportation database now. Sir, there's just one. Mercy Street Station. It's one of the busiest places in the city. Thousands of people go in and out every hour. These barrels match the shrapnel that I found at the docks. Mercy Street. But how are they planning to release it? Someone's been practicing chemistry. Something spilled here. This is the drug they've been using. Refined. It's the same as the one given to Montoya and Harvey. This solvent increases dermal permeability. Looks like they ran out of the absorbing agent. This train car has been modified. How do you mean? Clearly the holding tank. It's empty. For now. Looks like some kind of sprinkler system. Doubtful they're planning to put out fires. The train car is their delivery system. Maximum coverage. Traces of both chemicals here. The drug is being modified here. They're changing it. The drug. The children of Arkham must have found a way to weaponize it. With a drug that can absorb into skin, it will affect hundreds of people at once. They're loading the modified drug into the tanks on the train cars, dispersing it through the sprinklers. The timers are set to go off just as it rolls in over the crowds. We are prepared to contain something of that scale. Releasing a drug like that in so populated an area would be devastating. They could infect the entire city if they had enough. 
Good thing you reduced their supply at the construction site. Thankfully, there wasn't enough of the chemical to mix with the rest of the stockpile of drugs. There's a train coming! Take cover! Euh, c'est des petits malins. If I'd known you were going to make me lug this thing myself, I would have worn more comfortable shoes. Just add it to the list of your mistakes. Must be why you didn't come through on your last assignment. Hmm. We're down to our last few barrels since Batman screwed up the transfer. Oh, we have to make do, I guess. Okay, you two, get these mixed, loaded onto the train. This way. Their leader is here. With Catwoman. Catwoman? She's got more of that absorbing agent. She must have a good reason for being there. Stop by. She plays whatever side meets her needs. Currently, her needs seem to be focused on keeping all nine of her lives. Any chance that that is good? We're done here, right? Not yet. No, 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 no. There's no part two of this. I got what you wanted. I'm done. You might as well come out, Batman. I know you're here. No, no way. I did not bring him here. I honored our deal. Oh, I know you did. But now, you're a loose end. Surrender. Unless you'd like to see firsthand what a critical dose looks like. She joined poor Esther Cobble. Death might be preferable. I know what you have planned with the Skyrim. It's not going to happen. Then killing you both will have to be a consolation prize. Thanks, Bats. Train's ready. Come on. Je suis un peu peur de les yeux. Oh, c'est le petit jet, là-bas. Don't get ahead of yourself. I decide when this ends. Ça, ça fait mal. You have to face the truth sometime, Batman. You can't protect Gotham from itself. They lit the fire. We're just here to stoke the flames. The people of Gotham are stronger than you think. They won't let this city fall into chaos. You'd be surprised. Fear can be incredibly persuasive. Go on. Show me how you save your precious city. Just like the other.
Don't pass out on me. Come on, bats. Je sais pas ce que tu C'est pique. <rire> Stay here, ok? Just don't move. I'm just getting something from the other room. You're gonna be okay, Bruce. <sighs> Shit. You're lucky you were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? <sighs> <sighs> What? Showing up at that train depot. Taking on their leader alone. Repeat after me, Bruce. I am not invincible, and painkillers do not solve the problem. Mm -hmm. You weren't going to take them down on your own. It's not that bad. I've been through worse. Funny. Any worse, and you'd be sent home in a body bag. Oh, I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Oh, great. You can stay here until morning. I feel like I owe you anyway. That's twice now. You just keep adding things to my list, don't you? Selena. I told you I don't like owing people. Probably best to lie low for now anyway. I don't want the children of Arkham finding this place. I had it handled, you know. With their leader. I had a plan. Really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. I was just trying to help you, Selena. I didn't ask for your help. <laughs> well, I didn't ask for yours either, but here we are. Touche. Hmm. That was gonna be my ticket out of here. One last job to get the goons off my back. So much for that. Thanks again, Bats. There is another way out. We can take them down together. <laughs> Wouldn't that be cute? The dynamic duo fighting crime. <laughs> Being serious. I know. Things have a habit of not working out for me on the duo front. Mm -hmm. Oh, look who's back. Hey, little one. I don't think she likes you. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. Yeah, well, you've got most of Gotham behind you on that. Well, not most. Maybe half. Just trying to be optimistic. Tch, cut it out. Hmm. This really hasn't been your week, has it? <laughs> you think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was... Just like everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something just beneath the surface. I'm starting to see that for myself. Even you have your secrets. <laughs> Those things you hide from the world and won't let anyone else see. Are you saying you don't trust me? I'm saying I probably shouldn't. You're a good man, Bruce. But good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Knowing there's mm -hmm. no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. Proving I can. 
You're just listing all the things I like about you. <sighs> now you've ruined it. What? Nothing. I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but I've taken plenty from good people, too. <laughs> For what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town. The high is nice, but it wears off. <laughs> then you look around and see... Nothing. So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. It's not the same, but... I know what you mean. After everything we do, everything we're capable of, coming home just feels... Like a disappointment. Right. Hmm. I was hoping for something more than that. <laughs> Did I I'll make it up to you. Do I have to do all the work myself? Or are you gonna undo this for me? Let me help you. Mm. It's what you do best, isn't it? Trying to tease me, Bats. Is it working? The chest of evil is very close up. Dans le papa, le chat. <rire> le chat va faire la gueule, je crois. <rire> le chat, il est pas content. Il est marqué. Bruce. Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. Mm -hmm. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if... if you were... I'm sorry, I didn't mean to worry you, Alfred. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. <sighs> I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, well. Where are you, anyway? I, uh... I stayed at Selena's last night. Oh. Well, that certainly explains it. You got something to say, Alfred? I'm not judging you. Sounded like you were. I wouldn't dream of it. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around, if she's trustworthy. She let me into her home. I'm not going to go snooping around in her personal belongings. I understand. Merely a suggestion. At the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. <laughs> right. That might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Yes, well, I'll see you back at home, Bruce. Pretty strong magnets on these things. Very lightweight, though. We could use something like this. Scarlet Pimpernel, much ado about nothing. Petrarca. 
Didn't take her for a romantic. What's this one? Oh, the Gita Govinda. That's academic. <gasps> Who was it? Her cat eats like a queen while she's eating junk. <sighs> Vacation spots are just marks on her burglary checklist. Looks all right to me. Nothing growing, at least. At least she's got the essentials. brought breakfast. C can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just for a minute. I really need to wow. talk to you. If you want me to go, I'll go. But I have to get this out. Bruce? What the... Seriously? What are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. Bruce, tell me what is going on. I just came by to check on Selena. What, with your pants off? Back off, Harvey. Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... So stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me. None of it was real anyway. God, how could you ever think it was? None of this is about you, Harvey. What, so I'm just making this up? Yes, you are. This had nothing to do with you. He... He will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? You can't stop them. He can't. I may go down for what my father did, but I won't take her down with me. She'll be fine. Ah, oh, funny. Thinking you have a choice. Thinking you can save the people around you. Thinking you could do what Harvey couldn't! I'm sorry. What the hell is going on with you? Up until now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Oh my god. This... This is the monster they all know that you are. Embrace it! No! No! Oh god, this is what you wanted to see, isn't it, huh? The freak! Harvey. All right, now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. No, he's gonna make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it. Starting with you. Both of you! You're gonna pick that up. Who am I? This isn't you. Just calm down! <laughs> Shut up! Jesus, Harvey. Of course. Gotta be fair about this. Can't play favorites. They both deserve it. One way or another. <sighs> How about we flip for it? This isn't funny. No. No, it really isn't. Oui, il est complètement taré. Hein? <rire> Pour la suite des événements. Vous aurez à attendre le prochain épisode. Sur ce, je vous dis au revoir.